you just point the phone and then you see the sculpture of your hero. Uh, and your heroes are black heroes and brown heroes who have fought the oppression, who have fought slavery. And many of them have emerged very successful. So uh, we will like to show our audience some of these heroes who you have sort of glorified with your app and who you want to sort of bring back into the public memory. Uh, uh, Visavis, uh, the, big, the statues of the so-called oppressors. So that's what you're doing. Uh, so I think uh, uh, let us uh, start with one or two of the heroes whom you have uh, sort of uh, glorified in your uh, Kinfolk app. But before that, something very interesting happened. You needed money for this. And uh, you had to uh, get some funding for this cause. How did this funding happen? I found that story very interesting. Yeah, um, it, was, it was a blessing, honestly. Um, there, there are a lot of, of different ways you have to keep the lights on, obviously, when you, when you run a nonprofit. And um, especially in the aftermath of the George Floyd protest, there were foundations that set money aside to, for organizations that did the work of reclaiming narratives in the way that we yeah. did. Through art. Yes, the, through art and, and technology and education. And um, over the years, I, I developed a relationship um, with someone who I met through the Monuments Committee. Um, his name was Justin Moore. And uh, in time, he became a program officer uh, with the Mellon Foundation. And they have an initiative called the Monuments Project, where they're giving money to, to projects that do similar work to us. And um, over time, we were able to get a two-year grant um, to expand our kinfolk, our kinfolk uh, monuments archive and to have events throughout the country where we're talking about challenging our narratives, yeah. both in public yeah. spaces and in the classroom. So you got how much money for that? So we uh, received $1.8 million. $1.8 yes. million. So it's almost about 10 crores of money was given by Mellon Foundation for this project. And with that money, he and his team were able to uh, create this augmented reality uh, uh, heroes of the blacks. 